Well, hey guys, I'm uh, going for a night ride tonight with a bunch of guys at Griffith Park and I'm setting up my my uh, main light that I'd show you. Now I've ridden this with this many times before, just doing a little bit of fine tuning tonight. And uh, let me give you a closer view. All right, this is a anchor light I think that's how you pronounce it and I'll have a link below uh, to where I bought this this is 900 lumens which really brightens up the the path in front of you uh, I love this light and I, I've got it's lasted for all the group rides I've done I'm talking about you know pitch dark for a couple hours at least and uh, it's a you charge it it's got a built-in um, Lithium ion battery, he recharged. Anyway, it's not the main focus of this uh, video. It's the fact that I mount this to my wrist. And uh, what I've done with the help of my wife, who made some um, Velcro straps. So this is you can buy this uh, flexible velcro and then and then she uh sewed the the loops on the end so so if it if it's stretchy fabric like this then you can you can really pull it tight and you know wrap it around your your uh, wrist tightly and of course i'm using these uh, flex meter uh, wrist guards which are my favorite so I just put it here and I wrapped the two pieces around and, and what I just did now is I added this piece of foam. Again, it has some Velcro here. So obviously this is not going to be on my wrist when I'm mostly riding, but at night I can stick this on. And it's just technique for this particular application because when I tighten it down then it it compresses on the foam and uh, raises it up above the knuckles a little bit and uh, it works great okay so why do I like to to put my main light on my wrist well the way I see it is you have three op three main options wrist mounted mounted on your wheel and mounted on your helmet now if you mount it on your wheel, obviously it's only going to, the light's only going to be pointing where you're riding, the direction that you're moving. And of course, if you're going up or down, as we all know, the, the wheels stay, stay nice and parallel uh, to the ground or to the center of the earth. So if you're going up a hill, it, the light's just shining right into the, the dirt in front of you. And I'm talking about nighttime very dark riding conditions whereas where the light goes out you can't see barely anything so I don't think that's ideal if you put it on your helmet then if you want to see anything off to the side or if you're moving off you're going to be turning and you want to you know watch where you're going you have to turn your head so, so you kind of become an owl <laughs> you know wherever you want to look you have to turn your head and that kind of gets tiring after a while. And also, if you're riding with a group of people, uh, every time you turn to talk to them, you, you blind them. <laughs> That's always fun. So I think wrist mounted, that your main light on your, your wrist is perfect because then you can be riding naturally in your natural position, but you can just be pointing your light off to the side where you, know, you hear a noise off to the side, you point, very easy to this, and you don't, you're not going to blind any people that you're around. So it's very controllable. And I've ridden for a couple hours at, at night like this. And it, it, your arm, it's not like your arm gets tired, tiring. Unless you like to ride just like this, you know, like a zombie almost. <laughs> but if you're, if you're like uh, uh, House of Job, you know, where he's, he's always, you know, going like this with his... Uh, <laughs> With his uh, arms, you know, it, it's good to keep your arms mo moving. And uh, if nothing else, I mean, it's not like I'm I'm going like this. I'm, I'm just kind of like this. And sometimes you can just rest your arm against your body. 
and uh, it's, it's very natural and it does not feel uh, tiring at all. So thought you might find this uh, interesting for any of you uh, nighttime riders or any of you guys who are going to be joining me tonight at Griffith Park. This is a solution worth, uh, worth pursuing. Talk to you guys later.